Hi everyone. Hi everyone. We're um we're back from Disneyland Paris, aren't we? We are. We've been back for a couple of weeks now. Um, it's been like two weeks. No, actually, it's been a week. I've lost the week. It feels like two weeks. Feels like ages. In Disney time, yeah. <laughs> so anyone that's just joining us for the first time, I'm Luke. I'm Rich. And um, I hope you've enjoyed watching our videos. If this is the first one you're watching, then check out our other ones. Um, if you've watched our hauls before, then normally we have quite a bit of stuff. This year we haven't got as so much this time, have we? No, it was, um, it was the longest trip we've done in a while to Disneyland Paris, and there was so much to see and do. Um, I think we only got around to doing a bit of shopping. Yeah, not as much as we would hope. No. But we're still going to show you everything we've bought, so um, hopefully you can go away and get some shopping lists like we do. So we, we always, do that a lot. Yeah, we always watch videos before we go and then we know what we're going to buy, so... Do you want to start with the first thing? Shall I go first? Yeah. Okay, let's start with a pin. So, because we stayed at the Hotel Cheyenne and we do love getting pins wherever we stay, um, we picked up the Hotel Cheyenne pin, uh, which was eight ninety nine. So on the front you'll see Mickey in his, would you say Mexican outfit? Yeah. Mexican outfit with a little dangling key, which is similar to the Hotel New York um, pin that we got. That's also got a dangling key as well. Um, so this one was eight ninety nine, and it's pink on the front and Hotel Cheyenne on the front as well. Yeah, really nice. That's a nice pin. Um, I thought I'll start with some food. I've got some Disney pasta. So um, it's actually all in the shape of a castle and Mickey. I think you might have mini. Yeah, you've got mini there. Um, the whole nice gang. bag. It's a 500 gram bag and it was four euros 50. So it's quite a lot for pasta, but not bad for a Disney. We'll make um, a piece of that. Yeah, we've had this one before, haven't we? A few times. Yeah. yeah. Um, and it's it comes really up, nice. Yeah, it's a really nice pasta, so I recommend that. We got that in the kitchen shop um, in Disney Village. I don't think it's technically a kitchen shop, but we call it the kitchen shop. But it's the one, the first shop along from Annette's that's linked into another shop. So there we go, pasta. The next one we've got is, I'm gonna go for another pin, unfortunately. You're getting the pins out there. I'm right? getting the pins. No, I like pins. So, <laughs> um, this one is the Phantom Manor pin, which I don't think I've ever seen before. Um, probably it's probably been out for ages, but it's got Phantom Manor on the front there and um, with the, the big scary house on the front. And that was $7.99. Um, yeah, so it's got the the bats in the background uh, and a spooky colour. And, and we love that ride, don't we? And we do love that ride, yeah. Yeah, it's a great, great ride, um, Phantom Manor. Obviously Haunted Mansion in America, but um, Phantom Manor in France is really good. So I do a pin. Go on. I do a pin. We, we picked up the Newport Bay pin because uh, when we went to Newport Bay, they didn't have the pin in stock, um, but we'd stayed there, so we wanted to get it. So we can now add that to the collection. And it's got the little dangly key at the bottom. And that was also 8 99 But it's a nice one because it's got Donald on the front as well. Do you like that one, don't you? I like that one. Yeah. We do. And what it's else? blue, it's your favourite colour. It is. <laughs> um, so I'm going to move on to Simpsons now, which is something we very recently started collecting. Um, it's becoming a bit of a, a tradition when we go to Disney to collect a new Simpson. Yeah. Just one or two? A, f a couple, yeah. A couple. Um, so this one is Shelley May. <laughs> <laughs> So she's got her pink, pink, pink going on there, with a Mickey pink um, symbol on the side, and this one was five ninety nine. She's um, got a little bow there as well. Yeah, it was um, Shelley May. You can't have Shelley May without Duffy. Oh. So we've got a little Duffy Sum Sum as well, um, and he's got his little uh, Mickey logo on the back. Um, same five ninety nine, but we had to get um, Shelley May and Duffy. Yes. Because this time next week we're going to Japan. Uh, so those of you who've been watching our videos may know we're going to Japan and we can't wait to see the merchandise in I'm Japan. I'm so excited. We keep watching loads of YouTube videos about all the merchandise out there and I think we're going to do some shopping. I then. think we've spent like a million yen already. In our minds, <laughs> in our minds. In our minds we've spent like so much money. <laughs> it's crazy. We'll see. But yeah, because um, Duffy and Shelley may originate from Disney Sea, uh, Tokyo's Disney Sea, and it's huge in Japan. So we're going to... Um, by when we're out there. That's a firm confirmation. We are going to buy, buy, buy when we're out there. <laughs> <laughs> Should we do another Simpson pairing? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so we have, I'll let you go first. Yeah. Tick and Tack. And Chip and Dale. Chip and Dale, Tick and Tack, whatever you want to, whatever you prefer. So these are cool. We can't get one without the other. So um, these were, again, 5 99 
and they're really cute. Yeah. Oh, um, because, way. Yeah. <laughs> um, because we love um, Chip and Dale at Disneyland so much, um, we had such a good character. Every time we have such a great character interaction with Chip and Dale, they're moving up the chart in the favourite characters, so we had to get them to remind us of Chip and Dale. They're, they're quickly becoming a lasting memory of our Disney trips, aren't they? Yeah, they're yeah. always, always, we always seem to have the best character interactions with Chip and Dale, so it's really good. Keeping on the Chip and Dale theme. Yes. We also got Chip and Dale mugs. <laughs> good old mugs. For those who know us well, we can't have too many mugs. No, got matching ones this time, and they say Disneyland Paris on the other side. Yeah, and they both they say that, yeah. Brown inside. It's a flower on the front as well. Yeah, and they are twelve ninety nine each. And we both like them so much we got two mugs the same. Are we going to have them at the same time? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, we need to have them at the same time. Yeah, more reminders, and actually they can, the Sum Sums can just sit on the top of the mug. Wait, I need to see mine. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> there they are. They'll keep them safe. <laughs> so will they become Tick and Tack, Chip and Dale, Sum Sum holders then? Probably, yeah. yeah. There's enough mugs in there. <laughs> <laughs> You'll go. Okay, um, we're going to do stay on the Chip and Dale theme with this really cool 25th anniversary headband, um, which is really cool. You've got Chip and Dale riding at the front. <laughs> Such a funny little headband, the two of them holding on. Um, and it's got the 25 star there. So this is part of the 25th merchandise. It is 19.99, And we actually got these for our friends in America. Um, just to have something Disneyland Paris, and what better than something that's got Chippendale and it's got the 25th on it. See, I was going to ask you if you were going to wear them on our next trip. I'd like to. <laughs> I think you should. I might have to buy a pair myself. But they're really cool. You. So, um, yeah, I, I kind of regret not buying one of these to myself, so maybe next trip. Right, I'm holding you to that. Yeah. On our next trip, I'm going to make sure he gets a pair for himself. That'd be good. So they're really cool. So I think... I'm going to move on to something food related now, and yeah. if you've watched any of our previous hauls, you might recognise these. Yeah, it won't familiar. be a surprise. <laughs> it won't be a surprise. I think you can already hear the rattling. Yeah. Um, they're the, the multi-coloured marshmallow balls. Yes, we love these. <laughs> <laughs> they're six ninety nine, um, and we just can't get enough of them. They're so nice. Um, al although they're marshmallow, they do have like a distinct flavour. Yeah, each. I don't know if it's in your mind, or you think they taste differently. They're kind of a bit stronger than a, a marshmallow. It's kind of a marshmallowy texture, but they yeah. have more of a, a chew to them, so they're not quite as soft. So if you don't like marshmallows, you might still want to try one of these mm. and see if you like it, because the sugar coating is quite nice. Because I'm not a huge fan of marshmallows, but I do like these. Yeah. Yeah, so they come in all different colours, in case you haven't seen them before, um, and they're just really nice. And you, you see them in a lot of shops. Around. We tend to get it in the shop opposite Big Thunder Mountain, but I always forget the name of the shop. But um, it's the one opposite Big Thunder Mountain, um, and we always tend to buy them in there. It's kind of a signature yeah. trip thing. There's lots of things slowly becoming repeat purchases. There is. So I've got another pin here. This is the Disneyland Hotel pin. Now, we haven't stayed at the Disneyland Hotel, but we did go there for lunch and I just, I saw this pin and I thought we've got to have this pin. It's so cool, it's got Mickey, it's got the clock. Um, it's just such nice detailing and obviously everyone gets to see that clock on the way into Disneyland Paris. And it's got the lovely little dangly bit at the bottom as well. But that was a definite purchase and that was 12 99 And uh, I've got a um, cup which we got in the, was it the Red Saloon? Yeah, Red Garter Saloon the Red at Garter Cheyenne. Saloon at Cheyenne. Um, we chilled out in the evening in the bar in the Hotel Cheyenne one night and I'm a big lover of slush. Um, <laughs> and this was, I think, was 7 49 with the drink. And I don't know if you can quite see how big it is, but it is, it is big. It's a big drink. So you get it filled up with red or blue or mixture of slush. Um, maybe they do more elsewhere in the parks. Um, and it's in the 25 years, um, 25 years of stars long cup there with Mickey and the gang on the front. You got a straw there as well. Me to yeah, yeah, yeah I can, I'll zoom in for you a little bit. You can see the characters on there, um, which is nice. And the 25 years of stars, which is probably back to front for all of you. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that was, um, I had to get that. Because the price difference, they, they wanted, I think, four euros for the drink, but seven for the drink and the cups, I thought. It's worth doing. Worth doing. Definitely. Um, we got some more Chippendale stuff. We got some Chippendale socks, so you get 
one on one side, one on the other side, and there's two pairs of each. So four socks in total, and they were $13.99, tick and tack, Chip and Dale. So they're quite cool little socks. And I think um, Chip and Dale will like, if you wear these for the character interaction, I imagine they'll quite like these. So that'll go down well. We may well take these to Japan with us to see Chip and Dale. Yeah. I wonder what they're called in Japanese. We need to ask. We need to find out. We'll update you on the next video. We'll let you know. Um, food. <laughs> <laughs> um, popcorn. It's in a cool 25 years of stars pop there. If you've been to the parks before recently, you've probably seen this because there were quite a lot of them around. They were flying off the shelves. They were flying they? off the shelves. Uh, I think they do a similar pop for the candy floss. Um, but the popcorn was six ninety nine. You get a fair bit in there as well, and you can always keep the pot as well for I don't know refills. Refills. <laughs> um, putting some coins in there, a money box, yeah. whatever you like. So movie night sweets. Movie night sweets. Yeah. Yeah. That's nice. Uh, we also got this really cool twenty fifth anniversary um, biscuit tin. We did notice that a lot of the 25th merchandise we saw in our March trip had actually gone. So I do think they had some stock problems, but I'm hoping um, that they're gonna resolve those because we did speak to someone and they said they're gonna be getting more stock. But we didn't see this the time before, so we had to get it. It's got lovely biscuits in it, as you can see there. And those biscuits are nice. And it's sealed at the moment, so we're just waiting to open it, aren't we? That's quite a good going actually. It would it make is. a little while when it's not been opened. But it's actually, it would make a really nice biscuit tin in your kitchen for once you're done. And that was 15.99, and you get almost 400 grams of um, biscuits in there. That's a nice purchase. Yeah, so like you say, you can always reuse it for whatever purpose. Yeah, biscuits or tea, um, bags, tea or... bags or anything. So, yeah. nice purchase. And but yeah, I'll continue with the biscuit. You're cake. saving your favourite for last. I am saving my favourite for last, yeah. <laughs> I keep seeing Rich go for one thing and he's I'm not. I'm going to go for it. It's gonna but you can't there. see because it's down, all down it's here. down there. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, biscuits again. Um, so you've got Mickey and Minnie on the front there. It's a nice biscuit tin um, or a chocolate tin or a playing card tin, whatever you want. Uh, and the biscuits are really nice. So they're chocolate, a mix of chocolate and normal. Mm. Yeah, And you've got the characters on the biscuit as well. So I think you've got um, Mickey, Pluto, and Daffy. Yeah, nice. Yeah, how much was that? Uh, this was 9.99. Yeah. And we actually got, because this is a 25th product, we actually, it's got the 25th there. We actually got these for our friends Amanda and Mitchell um, and took it to Tennessee to give it to them. And then when we were on the way there, we really liked the look of it and we thought we need to buy one for ourselves as well. Yeah. So we, we did we did give it to them, we bought another one, but we were tempted to eat them, weren't we? We were. <laughs> so we just about made it. <laughs> yeah, I recommend getting those because they're really nice. <laughs> another pin here. This is an um, inside out pin. And um, it's a different one, I hadn't seen this one before. And what's quite cool is it's got a little lever there and you can flick between today I'm feeling. Uh, it's quite hard to see, but you can switch it to um, ang angry, so I'll just show you there, you've got angry on there. So yeah, you can rotate it around and show today how you're feeling. So that was a cool pin. So the question is, today, how are you feeling? Joy. Joy? Joy because it's Friday. It's Friday. <laughs> <laughs> um, and that was 9.99. What do I do next? Right. Okay, cool. give cool. it that away. It's rattling. So these are, fla are they flavored mints? They are. Flavored mints. You can usually find them on the till. Um, the staff usually try and upsell them um, when you're buying other things, um, and they are one euro. One euro. They so, I've, what flavour have you got? Um, it looks like dragon fruit, red fruit. I've got blue colour. <laughs> That's the flavour, blue colour. Is it? I don't know. It's because uh, you're French. My French is terrible. Oh, I don't know if it's just that. Is it blueberry? It could be blueberry. It might be. The lady in the shop did tell us the flavours, so they are flavoured. Yeah. So it's a blueberry and red one. <laughs> blueberry and red one. We're gonna go blueberry. You've got the characters on there as well, which is cool. I'm terrible, it's blue flavour. <laughs> terrible. And then um, you know you've got the machines around the park where you can put two euros in. So there's one actually as you come out of um, the Disneyland Park in the tunnel underneath the railway station there is one machine in there over the far right um, and it's just two euros and you can get one of these cool 25th coins 
which I thought was really good. So we got one of those, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Really cool. I think we got one of these before, but we bought another one just in case. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, sweeties, you can't go to this land house without getting some sweeties. Um, so these were one ninety nine, and you've got, it's just Haribo. I had the munchies on the way out. <laughs> <laughs> I needed something sweet on the way out. I think it was the last day, wasn't it? It was the last day, yeah. Yeah, so um, one ninety nine, a decent sized bag. And you haven't even opened them. I haven't even opened them. No. I got the munchies, bought them, and didn't open them and eat them. <laughs> but but they're like a bit like a pirate's theme, aren't they? So yes. Island of Treasure. We've got a pirate theme, different flavours, strawberry, blueberry. And blueberry again. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah, they look cool. Uh, I got another pin. I got the up pin. And we actually already have this pin, but um, a good friend of ours that we were travelling with, Holly, um, she bought this pin and I saw it again and I thought it's a nice one to have, to have out on display. So we're going to have one for our pin collection, which is safe, and then one that we can actually wear on the lanyard. Um, so this is one we're going to put on our lanyard uh, for our next trip. It's just so nice. So, um, and that was twelve ninety nine. So this is why we like being nosy about other people's purchases. Yeah. It gives us great ideas of what to get. It does. Yeah. I think you're on your last item now, the one you've been waiting. Okay. You excited? I'm excited. You are. <laughs> so this is the Alien Duffy outfit. How <laughs> cool is this? <laughs> so we saw this, it was behind it too, wasn't it? It was behind the till in the shop in Disney Village, the Disney store, the big one. So for those who know me well, um, I, I love the aliens, they're so cool, and I saw it, and because we're going to get ourselves a Duffy in um, Tokyo Disney, I thought, well, we have to put them in an outfit. And then when I saw the alien outfit, I was like, that's a no-brainer. <laughs> have to get it. So it's cool. It's got... Um, so it says, this package contains nightcap hat, pyjama shirt, Pajama pants, two slippers, and a plush alien. <laughs> How cool is that? <laughs> so there's a little outfit there. So when we when we get him home after our Japan trip, we're gonna dress him up and we'll show you. Definitely. Yeah. We said we'd always buy our Duffy and Shelly Mae in Japan where they originated. So although we've seen them in Walt Disney World, we've seen them in Disneyland Paris, we wanted to buy them where they originated. So yeah. that's why, and we had to buy that outfit there because we just didn't know if we'd see it in Japan. Yeah, and if we didn't and we got back to Paris and it wasn't there, we'd kick ourselves. Yeah, so well, you would. I would. <laughs> um, and the price for this was twenty nine ninety nine. Yeah, yes, not bad. So that is our whole collection. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, like I say, not as big as some of If you haven't seen any of our other ones, check them out. Yeah. And um, there's one from March, which has got a lot of the 25th anniversary merchandise on. And we've also got a video where we go around the shops. So although we didn't buy everything, we can still show you what it is. And we'll put links in the bottom. Yeah. So and it's one week till Tokyo Disney. Yep. And then in seven weeks, we are off to Disneyland Paris again. We are. I just want to say, we really had a great time on our recent Disneyland Paris trip. We met up with so many great people, um, so many chimney to remember, uh, but had su built such great memories. Um, yeah, we had a great time, didn't we? Yeah, definitely. So we'll leave you with Chip and Dale headband. These were everywhere, so you can definitely get these when you go. Um, and hopefully you can go and buy some nice stuff. If you've got a trip coming up, have an amazing time. Have a great time. Make sure you see Mickey and the Magician. Yeah, we'd love to know what things you buy, what things you see, because um, it might be that we haven't seen it um, and we might want to go and see it. Definitely, yeah. And the new parade is amazing, so enjoy the new parade. See you all later. See you later. Bye. Bye.